WVTM 13's Jeff Elias. I've talked to one of those people who's been struggling to get unemployment benefits for five months. Brianna Latham had a good job through a temp service until April. Um, the pandemic hit. I got laid off. The Montevallo mother of two has been trying to find work, but jobs are scarce and working remotely has been almost impossible because of poor internet service in her area. She says her company couldn't keep her on, but reported incorrectly that she'd been fired. Since April, her claims repeatedly denied for that reason. The result? Having to go to food banks to get food. Um, my car has been repossessed once and was on the verge of getting repossessed again. Power bills not being able to be paid, water bills behind. So all the way up until this time, you haven't seen one thin dime from the state of Alabama for unemployment no. benefits. No, sir. I haven't. So we took Brianna's case directly to the Alabama Secretary of Labor, Fitzgerald Washington, in Montgomery. Wednesday night, he agreed to look into the matter personally, and indeed, his office found Latham deserved her benefits. The guy on the phone told me that I did everything correctly, and I am being back paid all the way from April. So it is a blessing, and it couldn't come at a better time. More than $8,000 in her account today. Those back bills can now be paid. Through the help of you, um, I cried. I cried like a baby. It was phenomenal. It was a really surreal moment for me. It put everything in my life in perspective. Offering hope to others. Your voice will be heard. You're not forgotten about. Jeff Eliasoff, WVTM 13.